Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. Today's list, uh, some jackpot. Uh, this list was created by Podgeable. Um, I'll put a link to his stream. You can watch the VOD and him just crush six Skellige opponents in a row with this thing. <laughs> it was hilarious. It was absolutely hilarious. I think every time they bled him, he was always up a card. Um, so if you're running into a lot of Skellige, this is going to punish him pretty hard. The Louisa Savalo just carries you so hard to where you don't have to spend the ball and possibly lose that tempo. So as long as you can cover up the Louisa and behind like a czar, or if you don't think they have enough removal to get rid of it, um, they're going to be in big trouble. Um, same thing with, with Saul. If they can't remove it, it's going to proc pretty easily. Um, it's got pickpocket in here as well. It does count as a blind eye, I'm pretty sure. So you can actually, if you, it's kind of awkward though, because if you play this, then you get a bunch of coins. So you got to play a spender quicker. But it's got uh, Happy Gilmore's in here, the beggars. Um, if they get the bonded, it's pretty sweet. I mean, you get six points or six coins. Not too bad. Um, it does have a lot of poisons. Um, you got Morel. If you can hide him behind a defender, even if they have the purifies, like say Nature's Gift, um, you can double up in one turn, so it makes it kind of awkward for him. Uh, and Philippa can steal some pretty good stuff as well, so always a threat. And then uh, short round three for Jacques, usually going to work out for you as well. So um, short video today, guys. Um, this one I go up against a I didn't run into Skellige I ran into a nature's gift friend and uh, I think it highlights the deck pretty well um, once again definitely check out the uh, podgeable at twitch.tv slash podgeable thank you so much for watching I'll see you at the end all right Ooh. yield and save me some time this one's gonna be rough I think so we got the boat. Maybe we can get some bonded out of it. But is that too slow? Poison. Well, we get it in one turn. He always kills it, though. Maybe we drop the Seductress. Double Urchin doesn't seem right. We want to get the boat out. So this gets us to six, seven, eight, nine. So we get there. So we go beggar. I don't think we need to spend just yet in case we got to do something weird. It goes slow, okay. I so I think we play the urchin. They've so damn much. Anyone teach him to oh. share? Oh, no, that's right. Yeah, we get the boat out. So he plays it. Do we just yoink it? Mother Earth, I grant you my life. From you it came, to you it returns. Is it worth it just to yoink it? I think we have to. <laughs> I think Power, we have to. The object of dark desire. So it goes Dunka. Taking our berries. Would you like an arrow to the head instead? So if we go fist tech, we go to seven. Then we can play Saul. Boy, that's a lot though. I just think in a long round we just don't win. He kills our engines with rebukes. He 
place Purify. Okay. So now we play Saul. Maybe this... And me alone. I mean, if... He didn't play any rebukes yet, though. Maybe we play one Jackal and let it sit? But then he just plays... I guess if he plays Protector, that's okay. Oh, we didn't get Horde 9, though. Well, it just would have been a bigger one, right? So if we play this... I think he just goes for the 2-0. Maybe this is where we get out. We spent a lot, but I think the next card he plays, we get behind. This is too slow. We have two of these. This always dies. Oh, he's non-devotion too, so he has heat wave. So this always gets good, unless we have Saul or uh, Azar. Drop one of these. I could nuke the... We need the spender. We need... Well, we have this. I mean... I just don't think these ever go off. He's got a possibility of three purifies. Oof. So he's in it. <sighs> Got a hearty hankering for Gwent. So where do we go? We go points first? Or do we try to get the boat out first? We play this. He heat waves it. Because he has a Nero. He wants to play a Nero this round anyways. We don't have a Czar. So we just play this anyways. Oh, looks like some light raging. He plays a Nero. Or he just passes and we... Yeah. We seen that coming. So he goes to nine. We play the Adriano. Maybe waste a rebuke. We stay up. <laughs> we share the profits, not the work. I don't think we get the boat out, but so he gets, he's wasting the rebukes. That's good. So if we play this, it doesn't get us there. We just play the Urchin. Three, two, so one, this gets us to go. seven. Then we can play Savalo. As long as this can stay up one turn, we might be okay. I think we leave it there. We have the other spender here. So it goes dryad. Come to me, little one. So he wants a 2 0. So he gets 16, 17, 18. We just poison, he purifies. And he's got to play his protector. Oh, we go shaping nature. Okay. Well, that, yeah, that happens too, huh? 23. 
So we get this down and we spend once. Or do we just play this now? Then it gets... Well, he used Heat Wave. We spend everything. Maybe we just go slow. Maybe we just play this. Because we, we gotta go to seven, so we spend three. Nose, mouth, any hole will do. And then if he can continues so he goes force protect all right so how does he kill this lightning do we just we just use our leader to keep it up right he who knows too much kill the nine too soon So that stays up. Boat comes out. We can actually save the combo. I think. <laughs> I think. I don't think... I don't think... Gord gets him there. I think we keep our card. Okay, so he passed. Um, so this always dies. Oh, we don't need a whole lot. Yeah, we just play the Sea Jackal. Carry over the full bank. Can use this. Not sure for yeah, he's not gaining yet. anything else. We just have to find Louisa. This gourd's pretty good. That's good. That's not so good. It's a spender. A czar might be really good. How do we get there, though? Pickpocket? I don't think we ever get that many coins anyways. So we pick this. Soon you shall transform. Withhold the tribute. The life. Then we go seductress. Then we play Savalo. He already played Heat Wave. Oh, okay. Ten Ikea. Ted Day Red is nine. So he drops a circle on it, maybe? He's gonna have a boost. So yeah, there's the shaping nature. Alright. So we're sitting okay. We go Savalo pay tribute. I wanna see corpses! Corpses everywhere! Twenty seven. And then we pay tribute with Jacques. We have full room. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. Okay. And how big's that gourd? Clearly, I think we can decide who wenches. Let's add it up here. One, two, three, four, five. So it's only an eight point gourd. He didn't stack, so he doesn't have oak. The time, the sword, and axe, the age of the war. 40 so points! <laughs> Council into... No mercy! Does this get him there? He gets two... <laughs> Nope. We get that extra point. He gets 
Ooh. <laughs> Good game. Good game. Hey, that's the video for today, guys. Uh, once again, thank you to Podgeable. Um, I watched him stream this for about six games, man, and he was just killing, killing the uh, Skellig archetype, man. It was thing. So it, it can even beat this. Um, I had to get a little bit greedy with the, the leader, but um, there you go, man. Give it a try. It, uh, it seems like it can uh, beat some people up. Uh, but that's the list for today. Thank you guys so much for everything. I'll see you next time.